Thank you so much. I am like in awe at Falling for the Night, a time travel romance. This is book two of Enchanted Falls and it is just off the charts. I can't thank you enough. Right now it's a bestseller in time travel romance. Um, I'm gonna scroll down and show you something. This is so exciting. It broke 400 in the Amazon store, so it's at 397 right now. Number one in time travel in Scottish and ancient world and oh my gosh, thank you so, so, so much. I thought it would be fun to give you a little bit of behind the scenes look at Falling for the Night, the second book in the Enchanted Falls trilogy. Emma Prince's book is already out. That's book one. And Kira Montclair's is coming out in two weeks. You can see the whole series right here. It's so exciting. I can't believe it's doing so well. I mean, I can because it's fun and this has been an amazing book to write, but let me show you a little bit of behind the scenes. So I thought this would be fun. This is the character analysis, the character kind of starting point for every book. You can see it was called Leannon Falls when it started. I didn't have a title. And Leannon Falls is the name of the waterfall that the heroines jump into, the three sisters jump into, and fall back to 14th century Scotland. So these are some of the questions I ask for every single book. Um, a little bit about the hero and the heroine. We have Sir Tristan and Hannah Sutton. And there's a synopsis. Often I will start with the research and find some links and with this one, because Sir Tristan was an armor, he was actually raised in a stew house or a brothel and so I did a lot of research on that. So I have some links there, but this is the very first starting point of the book. Um, from there, I plot it out, but then go right over to the Pinterest page. Oh, there's a bunch of abs right there. Who would have thought? Um, so here's the Pinterest page for Falling for the Night. And you can see the manspiration, our hero, Sir Tristan, is actually Jensen Ackles, or that's who was in my head anyway while I was writing. And there you see um, Alexandria Daddario, and she was the inspiration for Hannah Sutton, the oldest of the Sutton sisters who fell through the waterfall and went back to 14th century Northumbria. So oh, there's Jensen, he's looking at us. Uh, some other things that you can see in here. So there is right over here, Kits and Forge. That's the inspiration for Leannon Falls. And that's the waterfall I envisioned them jumping in. I didn't want them to jump too high from too high, especially because Hannah is afraid of heights. So uh, Dunstanburg Castle, there's the inspiration here for Saxford Castle and over here as well. And that's where uh, Sir Tristan wants an armor. And you can see down here, I did a lot of research on um, medieval stew houses or brothels. Um, so not only was he an armor, but he was also the son of a bod or the owner of a stew house. So I did a whole bunch of research on that. And I know more about the Bankside area in London and the brothels than I ever imagined that I would. So that was actually very interesting and lots of fun. But, um, and there's Jensen's abs again. So let's see what else we have here. Uh, there's a scene in the book that I specifically referenced uh, the kitchens and coming up and down from the kitchen. So I imagined this particular staircase and I basically do a Pinterest board for every single book So you can kind of jump in and look um, they went to a uh, an inn called the Fox and Goose and That's the inspiration there Fox and Goose by the way That's a name I got as I was driving through England last summer on a research trip slash Vacation I wrote down the name of every inn I passed and that's where I got that from um, A lot of research on armor, but you can check this out all of my Pinterest boards um, start with, all of the books start with Pinterest inspiration boards. But thank you so much again. I just wanted to give you a little inside look and say thanks for making this a number one bestseller. I hope you're enjoying it and love loving Sir Tristan and Hannah as much as I enjoyed writing them. Have a great weekend. Thanks again.